Seema Ranjan Tapsi Pannu is a young girl who lives in Mumbai with her father Suryakant Santaru Ranjan Anupam Kher he being an active military officer wants Seema to marry an army man he had arranged Seema's marriage to such people five times in a row with Seema awaiting all five arrangements her father had now arranged her marriage for the sixth time which Seema awaits again and escapes to go to live with her uncle Chandrakant Chiku Ranjan her father Suryakant's younger twin brother Anupam Kher who wants her to marry a civilian Uddharan Chenne Siddharth Sid Kashyap Ali Zafar Jay Siddharth and Omkar Omi Sharma Divyedu are three friends who live in a rented apartment in Goa Miss Josephine Lilith Dubey is their landlady all the three are frequent visitors to a cafe owned by Joseph Fatado Rishi Kapoor the three owe huge amounts of money to Joseph and Josephine one day Omi spots Seema taking a walk with her dog attracted to her he calls Jay both of them try to impress her one after the other they break into Seema S house Omi tries to impress Seema with his poetry meanwhile Seema mistakes him for a dog trainer and takes him straight into her bedroom Omi assumes Seema is interested in him and starts browsing her bedroom while Seema prepares her dog unable to handle the dog as it bites him Omi runs back home where he tells everyone a completely different story Omi tells his friends that they had sex and were deeply in love jealous jay tries his luck jay breaks in telling them he is a reputed filmmaker upon realization seema calls her grandmother and makes her beat up jay until he finally makes his run back home jay tells a similar story jay tells the other two that they too were deeply in love and were now dating siddharth meanwhile isn t interested in seema uddharan However, one day, Siddharth accidentally bumps into Seema, unaware of the fact that she is the girl Jay and Omi failed to impress. Both of them have a chat over lunch. Seema is impressed with Sid and asks him out on a date. Both of them get along very well and date frequently. Until one day, Jay and Omi spot them. Both of them, jealous of the fact that they are now dating. tell said that she isn't a good girl and ask him to break up with her seema on the other hand is shocked about the fact that they are both sid's friends sid pretends to beat up both his friends to impress seema which later turns out to be omi and jaya's imagination albeit the fight they continue to try and split sid and seema one day josephine gets caught in heavy rain Joseph too was present at the scene and helps out Josephine. Both of them were amused at the similarities between them. They both fall in love but hesitate to start dating. Jay and Omi try to take advantage of the situation. They assume that Joseph would stop asking them to pay the cafe bills and Josephine would let them stay at her apartment for free if they helped unite them. In their many attempts, They somehow unite Joseph and Josephine. Despite that, Joseph or Josephine still don't forgive the three. So Jay and Omi start lying about each of the two to the other. They get the money they wanted. However, Joseph and Josephine do not break up as they soon realize that all the secrets told to them were lies. Soon after that, Sid and Seema break up. following successful attempts by Jay and Omi however Sid is deeply hurt and gets drunk later one day Omi and Jay find a poison bottle in Sid's drawer and assume that he has committed suicide even though he hasn't realizing that they have made a really big mistake Jay and Omi try several times to unite Sid and Seema again but they fail causing Seema to get frustrated and blame Sid one day finally they go to Seema's house and meet her grandmother she comes up with a rather filmy solution and suggests Jay and Omi to play kidnappers and supposedly kidnap Seema 
Then, the aunt goes to Sid and asks him to rescue Seema from the kidnappers. Finally, Sid and Seema start dating again. Seema's uncle, who had always been trying to marry Seema to a civilian rather than a military officer, suggests Seema to marry Sid. At the same time, Seema's father turns up trying to take Seema back home. In order to solve the problem, Sid unites the brothers by telling them that every military officer was once a civilian. The military officer or his brother are impressed and they both let Sid and Seema marry.